Hey everybody, my name is Jeremiah Craig and let's talk weddings today. All you ladies out there have awesome options when it comes to dresses and just looking spectacular on your wedding day. But for me, I feel like it's a little bit different for guys and suits. Like I don't really look at the suit being the most important thing for my wedding day. I thought it was the boots. Today, we're gonna talk about how I chose a pair of cowboy boots to wear on my wedding day. Let's get into it. This year was great. I finally got married to my best friend and partner of nine years this October. It was literally the best day of my life, which is why I wanted a special pair of cowboy boots for that memory to be ingrained in forever. Then came the Stetson JBS Lizard Boot. And I think this is the best looking square toe with the double stitched welt available. I didn't expect myself to be so interested in getting married in a wide square toe. It's not really my style, but it just looked great on me. So I went suit shopping and made my choices of colors specifically around the colors in this vamp. I ended up getting a custom suit from Men's Warehouse. It is like this wine burgundy color and it finally came back today and they're gonna do the second fitting. So let's see what it looks like and how this is all gonna go down. This is so much fun. Wow, that yeah, is so oh, cool. That picked a great lining too, I love that. That does look slick. Mm, it does. Man, I can't wait to try this on. I liked how the color of the wine suit worked with the honey or cognac color of the lizard boot. But I wasn't so much a fan of how the pants sagged into the shaft of the boot. And there wasn't a way for the tailors at Men's Warehouse to taper the pant, they could only leave it long so that I could get that stacked look with a dress pan. So I was wondering what I was going to do next because I wasn't so much a fan of this boot with that suit. I was actually thinking of trying to tie it up top so that I wouldn't get all of that sag. A week later, the Yeehaw Cowboy came in tail snip toe, came in the mail and I was doing my review on it and the next day I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try this boot with my suit. I tried these boots with these pants and it was an immediate reaction. I knew I had to get married in these Yeehaw Cowboy Came and Tail Snip Toe boots. They were perfect. They look so great. Cayman is one of my favorite exotic leathers, plus it's just a spectacular looking boot all the way around. Like, how could I not? How could I say no to this? Another thing that was such a big benefit was that these pants don't sag into the shaft as much as they did with the Stetson Square Toe Lizard boots over here. You still can see some of the outline of the shaft, but it's not as apparent and it doesn't bother me really. These are very light pants, very light material, so it's not like jeans or anything like that. And I know several people get married in jeans and cowboy boots, but that's not the look I was going for. I was going for a suit and cowboy boots and it was achieved with these Yeehaw Cowboy Boot came in tail, snip toes, I love it. I know I kinda lucked out at the end because I did not expect these to arrive before my wedding day, but they did and it was perfect. I'm so happy that I made this boot the boot for my wedding. I couldn't imagine getting married in any other pair. Let me know what boots you guys got married in and I know if you are like me that you see those boots as very special boots that contain the memory of your marriage. Let me know down in the comments what boot you got married in and if you approached choosing your boots for your wedding day in a similar way. 
My name is Jeremiah Craig, and I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching. Peace. Oh, don't you know? You got to pick the right boots for your wedding day. Cause those best memories, amazing times, they're bound to stay forever in that pair, the perfect pair. My name is Jeremiah Craig, thank you for watching today. Don't forget to comment and subscribe, I'll see you next time for